Hey everybody, just a quick update for this week. Looks like a giant pile of insulation there. I continued my way across, and you can see the passenger side is now relatively clear. This big old mass of wires needs some uh, work here, obviously, but uh, you know, I'm gonna work in my way around. Um, I'm probably going to pull the rear. Uh, rear plastic panels here. These here are need to come out. I don't think there's actually very much insulation behind them. There's probably some pads and things like that, but they need to come out. Obviously I'm going to pull the seats at some point here real soon. And then this side. Uh, I bought uh, the closed cell insulation. I also have the uh, kind of replacement for this stuff here. Uh, for placing in there on the floor. I don't know what kind of coverage I'm going to do with the with this metallic stuff, but we'll see. Uh, I've read that you only need to put sheets on 25% and then the closed cell stuff will go on 100%, but I do have two boxes of both, so I might as well just slap it on and go crazy with it. So, uh, I don't know what I'm going to do about the headliner. I've never removed the headliner in this car. Let's see if we can... It's, it's in really good shape, and that kind of makes me nervous. If I was to do something with it, it probably wouldn't be in good shape anymore, so I don't know. We'll see, because I'd like to put some... I don't know what's up here. It feels like it's relatively insulated as far as sound. Uh, I mean, it's got a nice kind of tap to it, so I think I might just leave it alone. Um, probably focus on the floor, the doors and uh, depending on how crazy I get with behind the dash here, pulling the dash out and uh, working behind the dash because the insulation, the factory insulation at least, goes up underneath this, the along the transmission tunnel here uh, and then there's this big pad that's on the on the firewall um, I don't know, I haven't decided. If you have any comments on what to do here, let me know. But, uh, you know, I'm gonna continue scraping. I'm quitting for the day because just because it's so hot with the heat gun. Even when it's air conditioned in my garage here, it's still pretty damn hot in here. So, uh, I can only do this for so long before I start to get dehydrated and <laughs> I just sweat so much. I mean, look at this giant pile of crap here. So, uh, Alright, well, until next time, thanks for tuning in.